We have one final video, a challenge guide. We're going for safe room explosion as you saw there and watch your step. In this Hitman challenge guide, it's a very simple prospect. You need to initiate a code 17. In order to do that, you have to pacify Novikov's personal bodyguard. Now, I found the best way to do this without, of course, having to knock out uh, Viktor Novikov himself is to dress like the waiter, as I am right now, head into this room here, and learn about the evacuation process. If you don't do that, then even when you knock out the bodyguard, it won't help you. So it's an intel, very easy to do. Of course, before you've done this, um, this will be a to-go one, or at least a reload to save. Make sure you have a remote explosive to do this. Okay. Inside, heading upstairs. Uh, the reason I'm going upstairs is because I found the best place to actually grab Novikov and his bodyguard is the bathroom on this side. So I'm following him around, as you can see, going around, trying to see where would be the best place. It takes a little bit of doing, though. I, I can honestly say I had to reload 10, maybe 15 times to get it exactly right. So, Novikov and his bodyguard are on the other side. We're walking around as best we can, getting distracted. And here in this bathroom, where there's a waiter waiting on the side, this is where you need to throw a coin or turn on the water right as the bodyguard is walking by. You need to time it pretty perfectly, though. You do it a little too early, it's not going to work. Do it a little too late, and he'll miss it completely. So here we are. I slowed it down, opened it up here, and I just got it right. He just went inside. Door closed. Grabbed. Okay, so very, very simple. You don't need to dress as him, but it does make the next steps a lot easier. I have the disguise, and I have his gun, and I also have his phone, which is very important for that code 17. So head upstairs, it's on the second floor where both of the targets will run to. Run our way there. Try to stay out of the way of the other bodyguards because they will all come running, they may spot you, Victor may spot you, which uh, can be a little bit difficult. We're heading upstairs again. It takes a bit for both of the characters to get down here, but this should be your final challenge if you've been following our guides. I think we've been able to grab literally every single one. So here we are following Victor as he runs around. Code 17 did not disappoint. Coming into this area here. And there may be some issues, you know, there may be some glitches here. We had to do this a few times, but as long as you kill both of them with an explosive or with a chandelier, you're going to get it all right. So now we have them uh, both in here. We're going for watch your step. This is after the other guards have left. Very, very simple. Both the characters are standing under the chandelier. A quick flip of the switch. Boom. Both dead. Very, very easy. It's okay even if you kill another bodyguard. Now, that is for watch your step. Make sure you complete it. Don't reload just yet. Completed the mission. Reloading that save. Heading inside here. You didn't actually have to do this with a remote explosive, but it is pretty fun to throw a remote explosive, understand that Victor and Dahlia know they're about to die, and then watch them blow up. So here we are, throwing the explosive right at their feet. No. Detonates. And there you have it. Your challenge is watch your step and safe room explosion. Two of the challenges you probably needed to fill out your memorandum of fun. Keep watching for more. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Wasn't that something? Sebastian Sato, everybody. Now, I know what you're thinking. Get off stage, Viktor Novikov. <laughs> yes, yes, quite right, quite right. This is Sebastian's big... Both targets are down. Great work. Now head towards an exit.